Welcome back. We're in the Fox 61 by Carrie, your kitchen. We're talking about Easter options. Image marketing lifestyle expert Elizabeth Zygmunt is joining us. And Easter is just a few days away. It's always sort of stressful when you're planning. You have the menu, who's coming over, activities, Easter egg hunts. So we're talking about easy ways to alleviate some of the stress, right? Exactly. We have so many things to worry about for Lots Easter. Of and you don't want to forget about your tablescape. So we'll start right. with that first. When people come to your home. And these are great home, easy options, which I really, really exactly. like. Exactly. It might be things you already have or just need to run to the store for a few more fun things right. to put in. Right, right. But here we'll start. This is a trifle bowl mm. that's from William Sonoma from Evergreen Walk. We did some shopping, grabbed this, and all we did was put in a glass clear vase. Right. You can also use like a Tupperware. This is, yeah. We use yeah. You just plastic. use a Tupperware and drop that into the center after you put the jelly beans and the peeps. Yes, just layer it all it in so there, easy. all the jelly beans and peeps. And a lot of people already have that at home. Right, and then you just stick the flowers in mm -hmm. and it's a beautiful little display. That's right, and the kids can get involved with this too. Which right, makes I think it really great. they would love to get involved Get in them that. all involved. And this is another one too, because you might have some Easter eggs from the years exactly. past. Exactly, we all have these in our, them. hanging around the whole house, yeah. right? This is from Pottery Barn, so it's a great piece to really interchange per season. Mm -hmm. So for Easter, we got some botanicals from Pottery Barn, fill that, and then just put some fun Easter eggs in there just to make it really festive mm -hmm. and fun, a little elevated look for your table. Yeah, and this is another thing that you might already have at home. Exactly. Just sort of recycle it, repurpose it. Exactly. It's really helpful. It saves some money too. Right. And then you can use that again from summer, put some sand and shells in there. and Exactly. Then Exactly. Rotate it through the seasons. I love this board. This is so fun to bring to um, your Easter get, dinner. Kids are great putting these things together too. Exactly. Just make sure they don't eat everything first before it gets to the table. Exactly. So we started with the board um, from William Sonoma. They're everywhere. Um, and then some fun treats from Stonewall Kitchen at Evergreen Walk. Some scones. There's some great mixes to make scones. Are beautiful. Sugar They're cookies. So cute. And I love of, these. of course, you need some jelly beans and some fun Easter yeah. candy to incorporate. So you into just it. go to the drugstore and get a couple bags of candy too. Right. And it looks colorful and very, very festive. Mm -hmm. oh, perfect. And of course, when you're uh, arriving to your mm -hmm. Easter destination, you want to have a little bit of hostess gift or at least something for the kids. Right. The kids always want something fun. So mm -hmm. why not think out of the basket, right? The kids always get an Easter basket. Why not get them these something so they cute. need? This is, these are rain boots from Carter's at Evergreen Walks. So we thought that'd be a great kind of like fun little festive little and these treat for the kids. Poppets are the fun. Poppets are just They're from the paper so store. Still. Everyone loves Poppets. Mm -hmm. um, some fun Easter books and little crayons and um, sidewalk chalk. And then that lunch bag. Who doesn't need a lunch bag for work? Right. So if you're going to a party, you can just fill it with some fun Easter I love things. this dish towel. And right. you always need new dish towels, right? You do. You, do. you, you need seasonal through. ones, right? Absolutely. To you gotta toss them when they just get so yucky and nasty. But this is perfect. Where is this one from? That's from Stonewall Kitchen also. This is cute, 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 cute. Yeah, they have some great things there. Yeah. And then of course we've got the other candies. The peeps, these are always good. Not necessarily to eat, at least. <laughs> I don't love the peeps. I don't. Do you? The kids love them, so they're so but they're sugary. also great for decorations too because they are right. so cute and they're cheap. Exactly, they're like a exactly. dollar or two. All right, a great filler. Yeah, yeah. These are all great ideas, and I love those napkins too. Yes, those are from Stonewall Kitchen Just as well. Just a cute little detail, right? Right. It's all very important to have those finishing touches on your table, so mm -hmm. everything is complete for the holiday season. Thanks so much for these ideas. I really like this one. That's great. I have actually done that before at the house with so tulips fun. and the jelly beans. The kids got in on it, and it's just a really great project for yeah, them. Yeah, it's so do. pretty good. But tulips, like you said, um, whatever you have, really pretty. Yeah. All right. Thanks so much, Thank Elizabeth. Thank you for having Appreciate me. It. And of course, you can get all this information, all the details, and other little tips over on our website and our news app. Make sure you download the app if. You you haven't already it is free you can get recipes links and videos all that is there and of course when you are enjoying your Easter Sunday if you're at an Easter egg hunt an Easter roll send us your pictures we would love to see them use the near me feature on the news app and send those pictures to us we would love to see how you are celebrating